Thank you guys for tuning back in. You already know who it is. Migs B from Miguel and the Gang. Um, we're going to be changing up our channel's name after this giveaway. Tuesday, 7 p.m. Uh, Mountain Time. So if you guys um, haven't done that yet, go subscribe. Tag a friend in one of my videos on your social media and you'll be entered to win. If someone has already won that uh, giveaway before I drop this video, um, congrats on the win. And yeah, but anyway, if you guys are going to hit the subscribe button, please like, comment, and share this video. Today, I'm going to be reviewing my gaming setup, my editing, my editing setup, my desk, my workstation, my my everything, basically. I, I basically live at my computer. If I'm not sleeping in my bed working, I'm here working because this is definitely my second job. Um, so... Um, I guess let's just jump right into it. I'm not going to blab. I've already recorded this video about 12 times. So I'm just going to give you guys the real me. I'm not going to try to act. I'm not going to try to be someone I'm not because you guys know I always give you guys raw footage. Um, I got to get used to just doing reviews and not doing family vlogs, pranks, uh, stuff like that. So if you guys are seeing my face right now. I went fishing the other day and my sunburn, as you can see, I'm redder than red. But my sunburn it is peeling. So... Don't be laughing and don't be uh, making funny jokes in the comment section. But anyway, let's get into my build and I hope you guys enjoy this. If you guys enjoy it, smash that like button and let's jump right into it. All right, guys, this is, oh shoot, sorry, hold on here. All right, sorry about that. All right, guys, this is my monitor. This is, uh, I just recently purchased this monitor. I love this monitor. It's a 1440p, 144 hertz monitor, free sync, uh, G-Sync compatible. Um, I love this monitor. It has good picture, VA panel. It has the ASUS logo under there, which comes with the custom round um, thing. You could put your own emblem or drawing on, put it up under there, and it'll display that. But this is the ASUS XG32, I want to say. It's the 32 inch. I love this freaking monitor. Um, it swivels back and forth, up, down, height adjustment, everything you name it, this monitor has. I love this monitor. The backing of the back of it, it's even more beautiful. You have the lights, you have the ASUS emblem back here, you also have the ASUS name. Um, the blue ring right there, you could have it any color you want. There's a lot of settings in the settings menu, the menu settings on the monitor itself. Um, yeah, I love this monitor. Excuse me one second. Ah, dry mouth, but the stand on it, very good. I love that monitor. We're gonna get through this really fast. Moving on, um, I switched from a dual monitor, triple monitor setup to a bigger monitor. And to monitor my temps, I have my seven inch touchscreen. It's a long runner screen. Um, I have it custom made inside a five by seven picture frame just from Walmart. As you can see, I drilled out um, holes and spots for the plug-in and the HDMI which you can see it displaying my temperatures pretty well I love this uh, I got a lot of feedback on this on my social media so yeah plus I also got um, a lot of people saying show us your setup so that's the whole purpose of this video um, as you can see my remote right there run my monitor my monitor my RGB lights in the back my LED lights around right there too um, going on my keyboard uh, it is the Red Dragon Kumara K552 Mechanical uh, Cherry Mix key, uh, key Buttons, whatever you want to call it. Sorry, I'm not that perfectionate with names and I do not know why my graphics card turned back to red. But anyway, that's the Kumara 552. Like I said, I love that freaking... Um, I love this keyboard better. I had Corsair, Logitech. Razer and for being a budget keyboard, I would choose this one over and over again. So that's my keyboard. Um, the my mouse is the Glorious Model O mouse. Uh, a lot of you guys know this mouse. Um, lightweight. You could change the colors on. You could change the DPI. You could change what you do with the buttons on the side. Uh, it's very simple. Very simple. Very light. I like the honeycomb vibe it has going on. Um, I love this mouse. It also has the tangle free cord that you can move to any shape you want it. So say you want it straight, whatever. Um, cheapo mouse pad. Let me get you guys the, sorry, hold on here. 
let me this is the cheapo mouse pad so if you guys are interested in my mouse pad uh it's actually a good mouse pad i'm glad i didn't go pay 60 dollars for a mouse pad that's pretty much the same thing and paying just for a name brand it's probably the only non-name brand item i do not have that i did not buy i got this but enough about that moving on my still series uh, wireless remote when i'm feeling lazy i can game on that instead of my mouse i believe that is the i can't find my my box for that so we are just gonna say yeah so moving on um sound blaster g5 amp dac setup for my headsets uh, that way when I got a studio pair of headphones that I need that are maybe 200 ohm or more if not 150 ohm or more um, To push I can use that instead of running it on my onboard sound um, As you can see I got the Sennheiser game ones I got the Philips SPH 9500s with the V Mata boom uh, pro mic um, And that's pretty much all of my accessories. Oh, I got the Logitech Dolby 5.1 one, two, I think six, seven surround sound with the big amp right there. Subwoofer bumps. I love the sound of that. Um, let's see. Okay, moving on to my case. My case is NZXT 5, H510 case. Very small case, I think. I like bigger cases. Um, the airflow on this is not too good, as you can see. That's why I got my glass off. Uh, very good case, durable, but I do not recommend the airflow on this, is which why I have literally what do i have seven fans in here do i got seven four seven including pretty much ten fans but anyway i have my cpu i'm pushing a ryzen 7 30 how come my light is not on oh my goodness don't tell me my light died already guys oh my sorry um i'm pushing the ryzen 7 3800x cpu cooled by a deep cool um 240 milliliter um cpu cooler i cannot talk tonight i'm sorry guys i'm trying to rush through this and i cannot think like i said i'm not good with words i'm good at building give me something i'll build it but anyway we got the radiator 244 uh millimeter radiator cooling my ryzen 7 3800 x 28 2080 super uh asus rog strix love this card triple fan it's the advanced oc edition um holding it up is a deep cool gpu bracket um, I couldn't put it where it usually goes because I wanted to put cable mods plus it would have blocked my Republic of Gamers and it's hitting a fan underneath because this is triple fan so it came out good I like the way it looks um, I got cable mods they're do DIY cable mods from Amazon very cheap but very awesome quality guys I cannot recommend these enough um, I'm running the 650 watt Evga 80 bronze under there um, the Gigabyte X570 Gaming X motherboard. I got a 500 gigabyte NVMe under there. Uh, in the back, I got my one gigabyte SSD, and I want to say that is a WD Blue. I want to say if I am right. Uh, I got the three Corsair 120 millimeter fans. I got two Cooler Master 120 millimeter fans. I like the way that these push air through and keep my graphics card cool. Plus, I have the deep cool white fans in the push pull configuration on the other side of my rad in here. Um, oh, I forgot 32 gigs, 3200 um, RAM, G skill, rip jaw. Um, is there anything else I'm forgetting? If there's anything else I'm forgetting, throw in the comment section, guys. I literally recorded this video like 20 times. I'm still sitting here stuttering. But anyway, guys, that's my setup. I hope you guys like it. Um, I'll be getting a desk pretty soon here. I ordered a white and black desk to match everything. I got clowned on my desk during one of my videos I post on Facebook, a little two-year-old building this. So I'm getting the new desk. Um, also, oh yeah, my little stand here. This is my stand, my headphone stand. And that one is, I want to say, I don't know if it's a deep cool stand. I don't know. It's an off brand. You can find them on Amazon for cheap. So, guys, that is my setup. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hold on here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. And my battery is dying for my light, as you can see. But anyway, I'm going to end off this video because my microphone's dying. If my microphone's making a weird noise, I am so, so sorry. Bear with me. 
But uh, my light's dying, my microphone's dying, all my stuff's dying to my um, vlogging stand. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys liked it. Um, everyone's asking me, messaging me, can you guys show us the specs on your gaming setup, your editing setup, blah, blah. There it is. So there's everything down to my little seven inch screen, down to my RAM. So anyway, I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna quit blabbing. I'm gonna end this video and good luck to the winner. Good luck to the contestants of the Jordan 1 giveaway coming up. If not, if I haven't dropped this video yet, if it's already passed, then congrats to you. I will give you a shout out in my next video. But anyway, that's my setup. As I always say, live, laugh, love, and stay tuned because I'm going to be uh, changing the name to our channel. So stay tuned. I'm very excited for that. Um, I'm going to get some rest because it is like 2 in the morning. I love you guys. Live, laugh, love. Never hit on success. And I hope you enjoyed the review. We out. Peace.